With HBO Now's three-month exclusivity contract with Apple over, the service is continuing to expand to other partners, most recently Verizon and soon all of its 100 million customers. But right now, only Verizon broadband customers can sign up for the $15 per month service, starting with a 30-day free trial. Verizon wireless customers will have to wait on the company's upcoming mobile video platform, which has no official name or release date. An HBO exec said the home box office is excited to bring HBO programming to a new generation of broadband-only customers. And that seems to be the case. Along with being available to Verizon broadband customers, HBO Now is available on Apple and Android devices and promises to be available to Fire TV and Chromecast soon. Point is, HBO is pushing its new service more and more, and customers seem to be responding. Some analysts say HBO Now has already broken the million subscribers mark with its Apple customers alone. And the home box office isn't the only premium channel to recognize consumers' desire for cord-cutting options. Showtime, Stars, and perhaps most importantly ESPN all either offer or are in the process of offering standalone options. Disney is another, I think, brand and product that could be sold directly to the customer. ESPN definitely is one of them. But don't panic just yet, cable companies. With all the talk of cord cutting, Comcast and DirecTV still boast upwards of 20 million subscribers around the country. For Newsy, I'm Jamal Andrus.